Hickok 45 standing over here in the woods with a beautiful Model 97 Winchester shotgun. I'm gonna do a little training in the woods. I know it's an old gun. Uh, today we brought it out of the trenches and we're gonna use it in the woods, see if it's woods worthy and if it can keep me alive on a woods walk, okay? So beautiful gun. It's uh, one you would be proud to own. It's a little old and has a hammer. So it's a uh, yeah, older design. Who the heck designed this thing? Oh, that's right, John Browning. Well, we're gonna put it to work. And uh, if you wanna come with us, it's kind of warm and you know, it's getting that time of year and there's ticks and bugs and everything else, but come on, you might as well pick up a few too. All right, let's put our ears on in case we encounter some bad guys or bad gals. It's not just guys, is it? Let's put a round in the chamber so we are ready. We always want to be prepared for the worst because you never know. Oh, like right there. Yeah. Right away, there they were after me. I think they don't like me. I mean, what did I ever do to them? Well, <laughs> I guess I have uh, finished off quite a few of their cousins, you think? Brothers, sisters, whatever. Uh oh, there's an orange one. Uh, it must be from Tennessee. Oh. That was close. Didn't have a round in the chamber. All right. Keep my eyes peeled. Good old pump shotgun, almost always reliable. Oh, oh look up there. <laughs> Blew the top off. Keep an eye on these trees too. They're liable to drop down on me. You never know, you never know. I have a bad feeling about this area, like right there. I bet y'all didn't even see him in the leaves. I almost didn't. I'm gonna top it off here, just in case. I always bring extra ammo because you've gotta be ready to do a tactical reload every now and then. Who knows, there could be a swarm of them, a herd of them up here somewhere, and I'm not ready. Gotta be, oh, there's one right there. Wow, I better keep it topped off. Kind of a scary environment here. Good old Model 97 though, is up to the task. Is that one hiding right there? Ah, I thought it was. <laughs> yep, it was. Got to keep John protected too. If I get let one uh, surprise me, or if I just walk past it, could be bad for him. Uh oh, speaking of that, yeah, I tell you. Uh oh, another one. <laughs> I tell you, it's a dangerous day in the woods. I'm impressed that some of you came along with us. You could be in danger yourselves, actually. This is one risky place. One risky neighborhood. All right, we're loaded. Oh, there's one right there. Yeah. I don't know how many of those things there are. They're everywhere. They're everywhere. There's a big tree. They like to hide behind these trees. Oh, oh look up here. Oh. Uh, come on, don't hang up on me. Uh. <laughs> Woo. Well, that was either me or the firearm. I would guess it was me. Got a little rambunctious there and double fed or, or something. Maybe it was extra hungry. Wanted to double feed. <laughs> Wasn't that hilarious? Model 97, ah, what a beautiful historical piece of hardware. 
it is so wonderful to be able to use it, you know, just to protect my life uh, this way. So we really appreciate y'all these things and especially you all, because you didn't have to come out in the woods today. You really didn't. You could have just sat at home, taking it easy at the pool. No, you came out here with us, bugs, ticks, everything, loud noises, shotguns going off. We appreciate it. Life is good.